All right. So welcome to Stardew Valley. So this is a pretty cool game because I've played it before just a little bit and it also resembles Harvest Moon if you guys played Harvest Moon in the DS and it's pretty cool game pretty cool games it's, it's all about farming getting uh, getting stuff getting a wife and mining and all all of those all of those achievements that you could achieve and I think there's also the town hall where you can uh, where you can find or get stuff and you can put it there and you'll get awesome rewards so let's get started so just give me a second to fill these things out and I think we are good to go So this is what we are going to start with. Our name is going to be Rick. Our far farm's name is going to be Rick's Farm, of course, because it's going to be entitled to us. And our favorite thing is Turnip. And we are also going to change the animal preference to this dog. And I think we... I think I'm going to choose the standard farm because it's the most simple so let's start Dear Rick, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Rick's Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya?
Okay, so that opening story is pretty good. It got me hooked. And we have been greeted by Robin. So I think I'm just going to skip over the this uh, introduction phase. I don't really want to bore you guys with this stuff. So I'll just cut the video now. Okay, so we are starting now and let's move around real quick check the controls and looks like we have a gift over here let's open it up and we have got parsnip seeds 15 15 parsnip seeds and it was sent by mayor Lewis that's pretty generous and welcoming Wow, so I think let's check the weather report so that we know the weather for tomorrow and it looks like looks like it's going to be sunny all day and let's check the fortune teller and it looks like we are going to have a little bit of luck. let's I'm just gonna clean up some of this stuff and plant the seeds so I'll be back all right looks like uh, I'm about to finish watering the seeds and I think we are going to head over to the town and meet some people over there Okay, so we are now at the town. Let's check the calendar. Looks like it's going to be Mary Lewis's birthday on Sunday. Let's go in and looks like there are some people over here. And let, let's greet let's greet them for a second. Let's introduce ourselves because it's on the quest and I want to finish every quest that the game throws at us and the backpack upgrade is 2000 gold that's so expensive so let's buy some potato seeds we're gonna plant them at our farm and let's also buy uh, some bean starter Let's spend all, our, all of our money on that. And let's head back and plant these seeds. Alright, we are back at the farm. So let me get, so just give me a couple of seconds to plant these seeds. I'll be back. And it looks like I'm about to finish so I'm just gonna place these bean starter packs and water them because I don't want them to dry out and let's just gather some resources because we are gonna need this to build all sorts of thing and get all sorts of uh, materials that are gonna help us in this game all right so let's craft a chest so that we can put our stuff in I think uh, let's find a place for the chest I don't think that's eligible there and let's just place it here and place our stuff in it the sap the stone fiber wood clay all of that stuff uh, let's also recolor the chest. Uh, right above the storage. There we go. I don't think blue fits the theme. 
I think I'm gonna color it lime so let's head over to the bed and sleep the day off and it looks like there's an event holy crap I've never encountered this type of event before I wonder what I wonder what's the effect that's so weird and it looks like that fairy boosted our crops look at that some of our parsnip seeds have grown instantly I hope they come back because that's so lucky that we we got that event so let's just harvest uh, some of our crops these green beans and let's uh, let's put them here so that we can get some money so let's let's water our crops first so that we won't forget later And let's also check the mail. Hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you from Willie. So let's head on over to the beach because. Uh, I think we are going to get a fishing rod so I'll see you guys there okay so there's a cutscene So that's pretty cool. We have got a new fishing rod or fishing pole. Let's test this thing out. See what we are going to catch. And looks like we are going to catch one. Oh, it's pretty hard to catch this fish. But I think it's pretty doable. There we go. It looks like we have got a herring. It's 8 inches in length. So let's sell this fish to Willy. Let's introduce ourselves first because that's on the quest as always. And let's see. There's a bamboo pole which he, which he sells for 500. There's also fish tanks but I think we are going to get that soon when we have a lot of money 
Let's get some clam over here. That's pretty neat. I think I think we're gonna need this because it's on the town hall quests, I think. If I'm not mistaken. Looks like there's a cockle too, which we're gonna keep and let's head on over to let's give first uh, Mayor Lewis this daffodil and looks like he liked it let's introduce ourselves to the uh, local local town the local villagers I don't know what you call them local people I don't know so let's introduce ourselves quickly because we want to finish this quest and it looks like we have got a cookie from that trash can that's pretty cool so I'm just gonna sell this turnip that I that I have gotten on the way to the beach and let's let's skip the cookie the clam and the cockle because we are going to need it pretty soon I'm sure let's so let's uh, sleep the day and just organize some of my stuff just quickly and we are going to sleep the night off now so i think that's going to be it for this episode uh i'm sorry it if it's really short but yeah see you guys later <laughs>